sagen, das ist ein Ripper auf Harvard. Oh god. Okay. Hi everyone, this is Chloe and I'm going to be doing a sibling tag with this one. This is my brother. Ian. Ian is his name oh. I A N G O. <laughs> and yeah, so we'll just get straight to the sibling tag. Woo. So first question, who is the youngest slash oldest? Take a guess. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> you are right. Um, so I'm older than he is. I'm the oldest, so I'm 22. And I'm the middle, and I'm 20. And I'm 18, 18 years. <laughs> I'm, I'm 18, 18 years, years older than him. I'm 18 months older than him. So he was born in July 1994, mm -hmm. and I was born in January 1993. And then we have a little brother who's not little because he's 18. big, but he, it, well, I'm talking about size too. Oh. oh. 18. And he's how old? Uh, four years old? I'm four years older than him. Yeah. And we'll do another video with my family down in Texas because we've seen them in two days. I'm older. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> I answered the question. Who is the best looking? <laughs> I mean, look. I mean, I... <laughs> so, I was the model back when I was, like, seven. And I know I'm not seven anymore. <laughs> so you're not a model. <laughs> so I'm not a model, but I still have a model. Good luck. Just kidding. model jaw <laughs> out there. Instead of having a tooth gap, I have an extreme <laughs> underbite. <laughs> Fashion. Anyways. No, I think we both look good. <laughs> <laughs> I think we both... <laughs> we have different looks. I think we both are good-looking people. I wouldn't say that I we're mean, ugly. That's, that's just what we've been told. <laughs> I couldn't... I wouldn't have that many notches on my bed post if I was it. me. <laughs> I don't even have a bed post. <laughs> I broke my bed post. Yeah, that's too many notches. <laughs> Funniest favorite moment together. I don't remember. <laughs> we have to think. My memory is so shot right now. It's fine. Favorite. Virginia's always fun, but I'm trying to think of just like... Like a crazy thing that we've done together. Like an us moment. We're having a moment. Have we ever had an us moment? <laughs> I feel like we have, at some point. Uh, Watching Will and Grace. <laughs> I mean, we used to go out dancing a lot together, which oh, was, was super fun. fun, and I would always be his wing woman. Mm -hmm. So, that's always fun. I don't know. We've always just been super close, so, like, there's no, like, like stick-out yeah. memories to be like, Oh my god! Because like, we have all of them. Because we have all of them. <laughs> we're, we kind of have that, like, telepathic twin thing happening. Yeah. Except we're not... Is just, a large yeah, is a, <laughs> I, I can predict what she's going to say. Say something. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, say something. A uh, sentence. Say, say something. <laughs> Hi, I'm Christ Christmas. Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Do you argue? What was your last argument you had? Well, it happened. Yes, we argue. All the time. All the time. No, we don't. <laughs> yes, we do. We don't argue. Um, <laughs> uh, we argue all the time, I feel like, but we are very good about, like... Resolving it. Resolving it, but, I mean, some arguments are worse than others. Um... The last argument we had was today, um, because I was at the bars with my nursing school friends, because we just finished our last final, and I didn't drive because his car is broken, so he took my car to work, and he would not pick me up because from Because I had papers to write, bar. and she was like, one more drink, and 15 minutes later I call, and she's like, I'm not even there. <laughs> I took the train. <laughs> From what it sounded, I thought she was already at the bar nope. prior to when I had nope. agreed to wait. Nope. Nope. So, I, my friend had to take me home. Thank you, Ashley. Yes, Ashley, thank you. Because this While I was writing papers. Stingy for bungus. Yes, my bungus. <laughs> He's a stingy bungus. <laughs> um, no, but we've had today. some pretty bad arguments. Yeah. There's one that last semester we were both just so stressed. Like I was working two jobs, and 
I also was like had it taking 18 credits and that he was taking a lot of credits and we both were just like tired stressed out of our damn minds and we like sat in the car went in the parking lot of my work and we screamed at each other for like 30 minutes straight yeah. like at the top of our lungs yeah and we both started crying but yeah. that sparked a new understanding when was the last time you were angry at each other today, today. <laughs> Telepathic twins. Oh. Mm -hmm. Who takes longer to get ready? Can you guys guess? Mm -hmm. No, it's not me that takes longer to get ready. I it's take... this one. The showers <laughs> are ridiculous. That's how I wake up. That's like, like I can I sing, go. I get to sing. I can go in the shower, shave my whole body, like condition my. F <laughs> condition my face, <laughs> condition my hair, do, like, do all of my routine, and be done in, like, 15 minutes. And he's singing in the shower <laughs> for an hour. That's when I, that's the best acoustics, and sometimes our shower makes a weird noise, and I harmonize with it. Like, mm. So then I harmonize with it. And then it stops the humming, because I've... Yeah, because he's equalizing the... Whatever. The vibrations. Mm -hmm. Sure. We know what we're talking about. <laughs> Any um, nicknames? I have nick I've always had nicknames for him growing up. He just started having nicknames for me. Yeah. I, for the longest time, have been calling him Juan. I don't know why. Juanito, Juan Pablo, Juan Carlos. Juan, Juan Carlos. <laughs> just Juan. And then I've been calling him N lately, too, because that's what our niece and nephew used to call him, Uncle N. Mm -hmm. So I've been calling him N. Yeah. Or, I mean, there's a slur of... There's two. Other name. There's two that I call her. I call her Chol, and I also call her Clovis. I don't know how they started, except for Well, Chol. Sarah, Sarah, Sarah calls me Clovis Adolphus. Maybe I got it from Sarah. I'm not. And Chol, because the fucking cable company can't get my <laughs> name right on our billing statements, I'm Chol. Chol. <laughs> Miss Chol! What do you have in common? Nothing. Too much. <laughs> um, I feel like we have a lot in common. We're both very artistic people. Yeah, we just have different art forms. I'm an actor. I'm a nurse. <laughs> um, nursing is an art. But, no, I love, like, makeup, and I actually was a, was a visual artist for a long time, like, back in high school, and I thought I was going to be an interior designer because I <clears> love to sketch and um, all that jazz. And then we both do drag, so mm -hmm. have that art in common. Yeah. Um, I think we both like a lot of the same things. Well, as mm -hmm. far as, like, hum we both have, like, a similar sense of humor. I don't, our style is not similar. But I could, I pretty much tell him what, I mean, I don't tell him what to wear. She gives suggestions. I give suggestions. And typically they're always not. Uh, I think we have a lot in common. But where we have differences makes our relationship so interesting. Yeah, like, I'm negative. <laughs> and I'm optimistic, so. And he's also a shellfish. Yeah, I'm a shellfish. <laughs> no, he's, I think he's a little more selfish than I am. I mean, he can ignore When it comes that. to us. Yeah, when it comes to us, I'm very giving. But that's okay, because that's how I've always been. When it comes to other people, I'm not a selfish person. But no, but when it comes to me. It, it's us. He's selfish. It's different with family. <laughs> what was the last text you sent each other? Oh. Um, you said, I am heading to a bar on campus quick. And I replied, can we go please? I have to do some papers and send them in today. And that was like... The it. start of our argument. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the start of our <laughs> argument. Are you close? She's right here. Yes. We're about... A centimeter. No, that's not a centimeter. But. No, I think we're really close. We live together. We live together, so that's really close. And we've all, I think we've been close since childhood, really. Mm -hmm. I talked for him until he was five years old. First it started off just me talking to him, and then he would, t like, whisper to me, and then I would speak for him. And then, like, growing up, I don't know, we would all, we always, like like, hid our secrets from our parents really well from, mm -hmm. like, for each other. Like, yeah. always covered up each other's shit. Good at that. Mm-hmm.
because I mean he hid most mostly my secrets. I didn't have a lot of secrets to hide for him growing up because he was a goody two shoes until recently. Yeah, I know he's the first person I came out to twice. I was not the first person he came out to. Though. <laughs> it was just one of those weird things because at the time you had already been out. Yeah. And I was just like, I don't know. I don't know, man. Fuck us on a biscuit. I already know the answer. I can answer for her for this one. What one thing annoys you about the other? I'm lazy. That's what she was going to say. I'm lazy. Yes. If he was one of the seven deadly sins, it would be sloth. He's very lazy. Yes. Although I hate sloth. Um, <laughs> but I don't know. I don't think... What do you think I would say? For you. I don't know that I'm very persistent. I don't know. Oh, way to turn my thing that annoys you into a good quality. Oh, I'm persistent. Well, I am. Well, I agitate you because I'm very... I like to get what I want. <laughs> I would say the one thing she does... I don't know. <laughs> I know. Maybe, I know what it is. Well, there's that. There's one. one specific there's a one specific thing, thing that I do recently, that he especially. Hates. Um, when I say something and it's kind of like me whining and I'm really <laughs> tired, and then I, she's like, "I need you to do this." I was like, "Hold!" Like if I'm sick, I'll be like, "I'm sick," and I feel really sick. And she says, "I know, I know you're sick. I know you're tired." And I'm like, "Fuck you!" <laughs> well, because we're just very different people. Like when I'm sick or when I'm tired, I'm still like. Okay, I'm gonna go do these things. Like, I'm still gonna clean. I'm still gonna do the dishes. And when he's sick, it's like, yeah, because when I have like a one o something fever and bacteria growing in my throat, I'm not gonna want to do the dishes. Bacteria growing in my anus. No, oh, that's the one thing that he hates is when I say I know. That's how I say it too. Like I know. I'm like, bitch, don't. <laughs> uh. Or it frustrates me just talking about it. Just, that's ugh. fine because, well, what, I I don't know. I know. I know. I know. I, I know. <laughs> what is something you like to do together? Watch Will and Grace. We watch Will and Grace because I have the box set. I love, love, love Will and Grace. And what else do we do? We go, we go dancing. To the, we go dancing. We go to the dog park. park. Um, we eat a lot of pizza together. Mm -hmm. Um, Chinese food. I cook all the time, so we yeah. often... I know. I, he eats my food. <laughs> drag. We do drag We do together. drag together. That's a hobby together. That's a hobby. Well, yeah. Or art, form, petty. It's a hobby. A craft. A performance. A craft. Um, I mean, we live together, so we do... We live together, so we do everything <laughs> together, so it's what we don't do together that keeps us sane. Yes. Period. Like, I love having fun when she's not here. <laughs> And that's really hard. To we do. love having fun apart from each other. Yes. Okay. Whoa. Professional <laughs> yawner. <laughs> um, what? This is hard. Well, I have to ask the question. Uh, <laughs> what is each other's dream job? Well, it's kind of, I don't know. It's hard because I know you want to do nursing things and open up clinic things and do all that jazz, but I know, like, also you're an artistic person, so I'm not sure if you could, like, like, if you won the lottery today, what you would do with your time. I know you'll still probably open up a clinic and all oh, that yeah, stuff, sure, I but I feel like you would design and rebuild houses and do charity work or something. I don't know. That's pretty much my dream job. I, I want to do nursing, like, I want to be a nurse practitioner and open up a uh, clinic for trans women or trans people. Um, like an all-encompassing, like, meets all needs trans clinic. And then I would also flip houses and do housing design on the side. I know for him, he just wants to be an actor. Make it big in Hollywood. On the, on the silver screen. Or on the big Broadway. Or on Broadway. But most Either. likely... I'm fine with both. Film. Although I have a great stage personality. He does. And he stole one of my strapless bras and put glitter glue all over it for a play. Seashell. And the top that I wore today, I had to wear a strapless bra, but I didn't. So I put band-aids on my nipples, and then in the middle of sitting in the bar, my nipple was out. I did you a favor. No. I needed some air. 
No. It was covered by a Band-Aid. Show us an old photo. No. No. <laughs> Work or are you competitive with one another? Mm, no. no. We all, like, I'm very, very competitive by nature. If you guys take a strengths finders test, you find your top five strengths. And my number one strength is com being competitive. Um, I'm woo. That's my third. <laughs> I am woo. <laughs> Winning others over is woo. But I don't think, we don't really compete, like, compete in the same areas. Like, we're not interested in what each other is doing really yeah. like the field that each other are going in so it's not like we can compete yeah. even when we do drag i feel like it's just it's more, more of a like a camaraderie yeah and like a supportive because i mean thing. i've been doing it longer and i'm sure he can eventually one day beat me but i will yeah. always be the pretty one but you know i'm an actor i'm gonna devote my life to being a, a performer a performer so eventually at some point I will be better than you. You will be, and that's fine, because... Later rather than sooner. <laughs> Later rather than sooner. Yeah. Have you ever liked one of another... What of another? One of another's friends. Uh, have you ever liked one of each other's friends? I don't know. I've thought some of your friends were cute, like, like physically. I don't know. Okay. Say it. No. Well, I have a couple in mind that you would like. Not that like, I liked. I mean, not that I would do anything or that I would go f after, but I'm just like, oh, you're aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> like, who? Like back in high school or? Yeah, I mean, hmm. in general. I was friends with a lot of cute guys. The jocks. She was friends with the jocks. I was. I loved it. Um, your friends? I don't know. I don't really think so. You're. Your crowd was just not my. Yeah, I not well, I mostly scene. and I also mostly had girlfriends. Like I've never really and, had like, guy theater friends. Theater friends. Yeah, but never like I didn't have that many guy friends in general. So like there wouldn't really be anyone for her to fancy. I never fancied any of his mates. Um, I'm trying to think. Any now? Do you have friends? <laughs> <laughs> Um, I should be asking you that. What? Do Who I are your have friends? friends? I know, I have very few friends. I'm selective, very selective. I mean, there's a couple that I think are cute. cute. And I know. In I weird know. ways. Yeah, I know. Me too. And... Uh, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, I know you do. Um, um, but yeah. Yeah. Nothing really... No. I mean... But I just put her bottle on the keyboard. <laughs> so we had to bring Violet into the video because she keeps messing up the keyboard and putting her asshole on the keys. So... No! She's going to be part of the sibling tech! Daughter. What one thing can you do that your sibling can't? I don't know. One thing. <laughs> what one thing? Um, Wear a bikini. <laughs> I mean, I could. <laughs> this one would be beautiful. Um, I don't know. I feel like one thing... I can do makeup. Yeah, I probably will never be good at makeup. I mean, I'll probably be able to do my drag makeup myself eventually. Um, I'm not sure if this counts, but I feel like one thing that she's always been able to do better than me is to like be confident in her abilities. No, I'm really confident. <laughs> Not in like a cocky way, but just like know what you can bring to the table. I don't know. That's one thing I've never very felt forward. like I've been able to do. Oh, yeah. Thanks. I've never been able like uh, it's hard for me to tell people things that might upset them because I'm a people pleaser. Oh, I'm. I'm just like oh, your jokes are funny, <laughs> and I'm always like, <laughs> you need to stop. So, I guess that's one thing that I can't do at the current moment that she can. Um, I don't know. Act. Act. Well, I always give him a hard time because I think that, like, I used to think that acting was easy. It's not. <laughs> but I don't think I could do what he's doing. I mean, I think I could do, I, I think I could act, but do I think I could act to the level that you act? No. Not at all. 
Do I think I could put on as much time and effort as you do? No. He's very passionate. Okay. Last one. Describe each other in one word. At the same time? I don't know. I have to think. Oh. I already got yours. What? Yeah. I don't know. And it's a nice word, too. Oh, it is? Okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> You're so mean. This was literally the first word that popped in my head as soon as I read the question. Um, okay. One, two, three. Driven. Vibrant. Oh. I'm vibrant. It's like, I I get what you mean. Driven? Yeah. That well, the thing like, is, like, yeah. I feel like, and this kind of ties back to what I'm saying when he's selfish, but, like, he's sometimes selfish in a good way. Because he, like, sees what he wants, and, like, he won't let anyone or anything, like, like, impede him from doing it, even at, like, the risk of, like, hurting someone's feelings. But at the same time, that's good, though, because that's, you know, he gets what he, he does what he needs to do to get where he needs to go, if that makes sense. And for me, it's like, I, I am... I'm very, um, forward, like he was saying, I'm very, like, get to the point, like, very in your face about things, but at the same time, I do take others' feelings a lot into mm -hmm. consideration when doing things, so sometimes that gets in the way of me doing things that I want to do. Yeah. I was a Slytherin when I took the Pottermore test. I was so. a Ravenclaw. Okay, I chose Vibrant because I feel like it has a lot of meanings it's like energetic I, I feel am. like is a connotation of it um very energetic. energetic just a big personality I just feel like it's an all-encompassing like confident energetic big personality big colorful hair. <laughs> um I don't oh, know I hate colors <laughs> I just feel like like if you were to walk into a room of people like she would stick out like, for many reasons. besides <laughs> just physicality wise, like beauty. Um, she's pretty and she's no, great. I don't know. I feel like she has the eye of the tiger. <laughs> it's something, okay, it's like when I'm performing yeah, we drag, <laughs> we, uh, we always talk about it. You can tell when people, like, don't just have the, like, fire in their eyes. They don't have, you can tell they're not striving for something like people you can just see it in their eyes like when someone is like they want something. they want something or like they have they're gonna do they it. have a fire gonna, in their eyes yeah. they have, they're gonna accomplish something they're gonna do something great well, thanks or something so now that i've been nice to you for so long <laughs> <laughs> this is the nicest we've been to each other in a couple days oh my god so. this is so <laughs> thank you guys so much for tuning in to our sibling tag video as always, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you guys soon in another video. And if you guys like Ian, leave a comment down below, and oh. he can be in other videos. If you <laughs> don't, leave a comment down below, and he will not be in other videos. Okay. Um, otherwise, love you guys, and I will see you later. Bye. Bye. Violet, I swear to the good Lord Jason, be gone. Get down. You are the devil dog today. I'm going to shave you and put all of your hair in a fire pit. <laughs> Ugh, okay. Thank you guys so much for tuning into our sibling tag video and fucking up our video. <laughs> fucking up our video, Parker. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you guys so much for tuning into our sibling tag. <laughs> 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 uh, thank you guys. <laughs> thank you guys for being a friend. Uh, thank you. <laughs> wow. <laughs>